My presentation will be on that of contemporary visual artist Gerard Richer. Gerard Richer was born in 1932, and he was raised during the Nazi movement. The German artist created works beginning in 1961 until currently. He focuses on realism and photorealism within his artworks, using photos and paintings to create multimedia artworks that we know today. The first one is titled Seascape, which was on display at the Guggenheim Museum. Seascape was a part of a 2019 exhibition by Richard in which he displayed a few images of a scene of an ocean. This image creates a peaceful and scenic atmosphere in which Richard was attempting to create despite the chaotic and probably violent environment that he lived in growing up in Nazi Germany. In this photo, we can see the sky aligning with the ocean in which Richard creates a photorealist image. In the second work, which was untitled, was oil paint on chromogenic print. It was on display at the Metropolitan Museum. In this image, it's very chaotic and has clashing images and colors in which Richard tries to represent two worlds. One of his chaotic and violent world back home and the world that he aspires to achieve. In this third work, it's called Abstracts Build, and it's oil on canvas. It was a 1994 painting, and it was an abstract work with many different colors. In this painting, I feel as though Richard was creating um, a kind of beautiful burst of color in which chaos can represent good and how he could turn his world into something positive through his paintings. Overall, the chaotic and harm harmonious motifs clash, but in a positive way that represents Richard's life, in which his growing up in Germany clashes with his painter peaceful life. The materials that he uses with the oil on canvas and photographs combined to make a great work that we all know today. And the techniques that he uses are very apparent within his works as they create an effective image. And here are my works cited.